defense attorneys for two men charged in the November 2013 fatal shooting of a respected Knoxville handyman and father of eight don't want a jury to hear any mention of the pair's alleged gang ties. Prosecutors, however, argue Nolanda Sims and Andre Terry's gang affiliations speak directly to why the two teens gunned down 52-year-old Jack Hutchins outside his East Knoxville home. The attack was part of a gang initiation for another teen with them that night. Terry's attorney, Wesley Stone, made a motion to exclude any references to gang affiliation, gang aliases or evidence taken from social media posts as the trial began Monday. Assistant District Attorney General Takisha Fitzgerald countered the defendant's gang involvement is relevant to motive. Sims, then 19, and Terry, then 15, were among four people who had traveled to Knoxville from Chattanooga in a stolen car to commit random robberies during a bid to initiate 17-year-old recruit Quatavius Williams into the Rolling Twenties Crips Street Gang, according to previous court testimony. Knox County Criminal Court Judge Bob McGee said he would rule on Stone's motions as the evidence is offered during the trial. The November 30, 2013, crime spree, which included an attempted home invasion robbery of a drug dealer in Townview Towers and the carjacking of an East Knoxville pastor, culminated in the slaying of Hutchins Jr., 52, in front of his Woodbine Avenue home in the Parkridge community. Hutchins had just stepped out of his truck with dinner for his family when the four happened upon him as they searched for a new vehicle or gas money to get back to Chattanooga. Prosecutors allege Sims and Terry, each armed with .380 caliber handguns, stepped out of their vehicle and confronted Hutchins. Both men opened fired and Terry, the youngest among the four, shot Hutchins numerous times, including after the victim already was on the ground, according to court petitions. An autopsy shows he was shot seven times, including three times in the back. Hutchins died at the scene. A Knox County jury deadlocked during the July 2016 trial for Williams. McGee was forced to declare a mistrial. Williams is set for a new trial May 8. A trial date has yet to be set for the fourth defendant, 20-year-old Antonio Marlin. Sims and Terry are due back in court Tuesday when jury selection in their case is set to begin.